What's up guys? So <clears throat> I'm in a couple groups on Facebook, powerlifting related. And the question was brought up, um, you know, who is the greatest powerlifter ever, both male and female. Uh, male, you know, typically Ed Cohen gets uh, referred to the most for good reason. You know, you see some Larry Wheels, I think Kaz was mentioned. Um, anyway, on the female side, uh, I saw Steffi Cohen... CC Holcomb, Mariana Gasparian. However, I didn't see mentioned was April Mathis. And I don't understand why, um, honestly, she should be a living legend uh, in regard to the female powerlifting. And I will tell you why. Uh, her rap total, all time rap total, 1703 pounds that's 103 pounds more than second place so she's in a league of her own um she's the only woman who's ever benched 200 kilos raw uh, i think her best bench is 451 maybe um all-time squat world record uh both wrapped and unwrapped uh 705 pounds with wraps i think 615 without wraps um so, you know, record bench, record squat, um, in both raw divisions, record squat. Uh, she pulls upper 500s. Um, but to, to further contextualize this, her unwrapped total is bigger than any woman's wrap total ever. So take the wraps off and she's still got a bigger raw total than anybody even with wraps. Um, and her wrapped total, uh, like I said, it's 100 pounds higher than second place. So, again, league of her own. And it's also only, I believe, 13 pounds off the all-time single-ply world record. Um, she'd be third all-time single-ply with her wrap total. And I'm pretty sure I think she'd be fourth all-time multi-ply with her wrap total. So, she is literally, like, the strongest woman that's ever been in powerlifting. And it is not even close uh, at all. So, you know, I... I I know why she doesn't get brought up because she's not, you know, some hot, lean, you know, built Instagram model looking chick. She's not. She's she's not that. But in regards to strength, uh, which is what powerlifting is about, your total objective, uh, there is nobody even in the same ballpark as her and I think it's a travesty that she often goes unmentioned in regards to all-time greats because she is the single most dominant force like in powerlifting women or men just given how far ahead of her peer she is. Like I said, her unwrapped total would be first all-time in wraps. And her wrap total, you know, puts her top five all-time in multiply and is only 13 pounds off, you know, the all-time world record in single ply. Uh, so, yeah. It's, it behooves me that she doesn't get mentioned more, but by far and away the strongest female that has ever competed in powerlifting, and it's, it's not even remotely close.